entire thing for one day and so far I don't feel that bad. Um, let's see, this morning I was supposed to have two breakfasts, two lunches, and two dinners. I thought that's what the, the juice cleanse called for, but I actually think that they recommend two different drinks that you can have um, to pit and to pick one. So I was trying to eat uh, six total, but there was no way. Like I was getting so full this morning. I was not able to finish my second breakfast one and I wasn't able to finish my second second lunch one so I think I'm just misinterpreting the menu and that they're just like giving you options to choose from, choose from versus saying to drink six drinks because I think um, that they're recommending you drink extra ones if you start feeling bad or if you start getting hungry and need a headache that you can go ahead and drink a little bit more juice but I've been drinking water throughout each portion of it as well um, I'm trying to drink 64 ounces of water a day with it so it just kind of helps with me getting enough water each day and then I'm also taking a multivitamin so I'm getting everything I need considering the fact that I'm only having juice and no food. Um, I was talking to my co-workers and they were having lunch and talking about good things and cookies and pies and I was really jealous but I'm gonna stick with this day one is complete I don't feel that bad I do want to mention that I was drinking a portion like this for breakfast and trying to drink a portion like this for lunch and this one actually filled me up so I think what I'm gonna do today is um, or I, what I'm gonna do for the next day is just go ahead and try to do this portion for lunch and breakfast because I was full. Like I was surprisingly full. I was telling myself, you're not hungry, you're not hungry, you're not hungry. I have a picture of Beyonce with a really flat, amazing stomach as the background on my cell phone to keep me motivated. So day one is complete so far, so good. Okay, so it is officially day two of my juice fast. So far, so good. I'm just now starting to get a little hungry. They say it usually takes a couple of days for the food that you've eaten the weeks before to get out of your system and for you to really start feeling it. And I actually am not doing this completely correctly. This is um, more of like a me blending fruit and vegetables and whatever and putting it in here and not juicing them. Like what I got was a blender, not a juicing machine. So technically, I'm, I keep saying that I'm juicing, but I'm like blending. I don't know the proper term for it, but I'm going to look into getting a juicer so that I can do that one. Maybe not next week, but the week after that. So. Um, I'm on day two of the ab challenge as well as day two of this diet. So far, it's not that bad. I haven't gotten any headaches. Um, I haven't felt like super hungry. I've just been drinking water, drinking the juice whenever I start to feel like I want some food. So, yeah, that sums up day two, y'all. It is officially day three of my juice cleanse and it is insane how much energy I have like I'm not even making this up I haven't been drinking as much juice as normal but I woke up early this morning I feel refreshed I feel light I haven't gotten hungry which is crazy because I haven't eaten food in three days so I don't know what it is but this juice thing is working for me so I'm gonna continue to do it along with the 30 day app challenge and I'll let you know how it goes Hey guys, so it is officially day four of my juice fast, and so far, I'm still sticking with it. I'm not going to lie though, I did um, have a craving earlier, I really, 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 really wanted a cheeseburger, but when I start telling myself I'm not hungry, I'm not hungry, it kind of makes the thought of food go away, but I don't think that this is something I could do for more than a week. Um, I'm not having trouble with it. I have still no headaches, no really, really bad food cravings, and no like my body hasn't hurt or my stomach hasn't been hurting. I haven't felt lightheaded or anything like that. So, so far, so good. Um, sorry for the attire, but I'm in the process of like washing my hair and stuff. And, but yeah, day four is complete, and so far, I'm doing okay. So. Hey y'all, so it is officially day five of my juice fast and I've had no food. Like I I don't know why I thought this was gonna be a lot, a lot, lot, lot harder than it was whenever I first started. The idea of not being able to eat for that long of a that long of a time, it was just like there's no way I can do this. But you all, it has not even been hard to stick this out. Um, I did kind of feel nauseous for a little bit. I went to see Chris this weekend and he had gotten um, Burger King and so like whenever I smelt it it made me feel sick now I don't know if that was like my body craving it and wanting food and me feeling sick because I didn't have any food or if it was like the smell of food was making me feel sick I'm not really sure but 
I didn't eat it. He ate his burger while I ate my fruit blended up and day five is fine. Like I, I don't feel bad at all. Like it's crazy. I have so much energy and I have, I've been waking up early and I've been feeling refreshed and I mean, I feel like this is really working. Now the only thing that I'm worried about is once I, once I start back eating that I'm just going to gain all the weight back because I've already lost six pounds. Which is insane. I weighed myself whenever I started this process and then I weighed myself today just because. I'm going to put a before and after of my weight um, throughout the week. Well, not how much I weighed specifically, but how much I lost in between there. So, yeah. <laughs> Day five is down and so far so good. Hey, y'all. It is officially day six. Day six. No food since Tuesday. Like, in my head, I'm like, there's no way. Like, I have gone this long without eating any solid food. It's, it is day six. Day six. I only have one more day of this and nothing, y'all. Like, nothing. I feel fine. I am waking up with more energy than I have ever had before in my life. Now, I don't plan on sticking with this for more than a week. One, because I think I need like solid food like even though I'm losing weight and even though I feel really great I don't think that it's good to go on a diet where you just lower your calorie intake so severely now I think that that might be part of the reason why I have dropped so much weight so quickly but I feel like the second I eat a burger or the second I go to uh, get chicken fettuccine alfredo from Olive Garden which I do plan on doing next week I feel like I'm gonna gain it all back so we will see how that works but y'all I do not feel hungry I haven't had headaches I got nauseous for a second um, on the previous day because I smelt food but I'm not even really sure if that was just like because I wasn't eating like I don't even know if that was related to me being on this fast at all but I feel great I am really proud of myself for sticking with this I have 24 more hours um, and I, I know I can do it like uh, in the beginning I, I read that day two and three were gonna be the hardest and that once your body has completely emptied everything out of its system and your stomach is empty and you're just on the juice that that's when you really start craving it and I I'm fine so yeah I'm really proud of myself for sticking it out and I will report day seven tomorrow and then get this video up Wednesday so I hope you guys enjoyed it ah, ah, so it is officially day seven it is the last day of my juice fast I'm going to drink my very last juice after this video and then I'm done I'm done with juicing I am done with not eating solid food for a week I'm just done with dieting and I cannot believe I really like legitimately cannot believe that I stuck with this, that I did not eat any food, I did not cheat at all, like that was going to be my thing. In the videos I was actually going to report like if I slipped up and ate something or if I just got a craving so bad and I could not help it and I snuck and ate something and told everyone else that I was still doing the juice fest, but really and truly I had gotten a cheeseburger nothing I stuck with this for seven days and I'm so proud of myself I feel better I feel more energized I feel like I've done a really good cleanse that I've gotten all the toxins and all the bad stuff out of my system now I don't know if I'm gonna gain all the weight back um, once I start back eating but hopefully fingers crossed I won't this was my total um, weight this was how much I lost. Like, how crazy is that? Here, um, I haven't decided if I'm going to continue doing this maybe in a week. I think I'll have a week off and then do some other form of a diet. I don't think that'll be this one because, um, I don't know, I just feel like it wouldn't be good to do it back to back. So we'll see what I do this side. But yeah, seven days. I managed to finish the entire thing. I'm so excited. And that was my juicing journey. My choosing journey, yeah. But, um, yeah, you guys, so thank you so much for watching this video. Thank you for tuning in. This is my very first, like, healthy video or any type of thing like that. I don't normally do these kind of videos, so this was more like of a, a lifestyle thing. I think my channel is kind of changing from being a fashion channel like I wanted it to be to just being about whatever I decide to discuss. So, so fashion and beauty, lifestyle, traveling, health 
reviews, whatever I decide to do, I will upload it on this channel. Um, but I just want to thank you guys so much for tuning into this video. Thumbs up if you liked it. Comment down below any questions. And thank you so much for watching The Fashion Bank. And I'll see you in my next one.